Hello everyone. Today I have this one e-commerce website that having some problem with the add to cart functionality. So this website I um, developed for my friend using Next.js and um, basically I just use create three trees, create three trees stack. You can go and Google it. So the stack uses TRPC. Uh, Next.js and PostgreSQL and Prisma as a um, ORM and so the problem I am facing today is uh, when I want to add more than one quantity of the same item or variant it uh, appear uh, two of the item in my card because uh, there's something problem with my code so I can show you here I want to purchase this. Uh, this is just example like uh, to know. I just put the picture here. So I want to purchase the red jam tangan nice, and I want to purchase two. And I click buy now. Oh, so so this is the previous state. Sorry, and click buy now. It appears like this. So what I want to achieve is if it's it is the same item. I just want to add the quantity. I don't want to add the item to become any like this, and. But I don't know how to do that, and for sure uh, we will go to Stack Overflow or Google uh, how to do it. But I need to rework uh, my function, my add to cut function. So I will show you my add to cut function now, and it's just uh, I can see the problem is here. It's just adding the state, the new item to the previous state. So uh, by calling this add to cut function, so the the button that I click just now, buy now, buy now button here, is just calling the add to cut function that adding the uh, item. So, um, today I want to show you guys the power of Copilot. I just asked Copilot. I did a Google and or uh, searching anywhere uh, for the solution to my problem. I just asked Copilot if item already exists, just add quantity. Let's press enter and then straight away copilot give me the answer so this is very amazing and yeah it's mind-blowing so i just want to share this with you guys let's follow copilot so for sure we uh, need to double check the solutions be given by copilot um, i think this is legit because uh, first uh, it checks if the item already exists yes if yes just add the uh, quantity to the item just update the quantity if no put the item set the state item yeah so you use this um one liner if else uh, um code style writing yeah so this is the modern javascript way to write if else so you just can remove the previous uh, items so for another context i use zustan for my um, state management for my Next.js app so uh, I'm not quite sure why I use state management well, I, I need to use state management or not but to uh, create this global state, ma state management for my card because my card here has this anywhere in the page to to achieve this I need to use some state management okay so that's all from me and yeah let's see for the next video whether this is this works or not okay thank you guys bye